think it's time to tell you all about the other side of the creek. We must be crossing into Hercleton Mills. I wonder who did all this. This symbol's all over the tunnel. It must be important. Get down! <laughs> that overpass was dangerous. It's even creepier than before. Oh, there's one of those wheel things on that barrel. Whoa! It's the Archer Kid! Please don't hurt me or my friends. We're just, we're just trying to go home. Home? It's not safe here. Please don't come back. I guess for now, some places are better left undiscovered. Jessica? I'm getting my alien wing. Jessica! Jessica, come back! You need help, kid? Yeah, I lost my sister. I'm Raj. And this is Sean. And we're the Honeysuckle Rangers! Rangers! She's this way! Okay, so we went about four backyards west. What are you doing? Uh, making a map to find my way back to the salon. Raj, this kid is from a whole other neighborhood. I know, that's 295 and everything. You know what? He would love to see this. Craig! Jessica! We'll help you get this jelly bean unstuck. Those symbols. They're like the ones from the overpass. Hey, no! <laughs> Sorry, Jessica. No one can save us now. What about that kid? The Green Poncho! <laughs> it smells like toots! I'm choking on toots! <laughs> this way! Why'd you help us? You chased me before. I didn't realize we were from the same side of the creek. Beware those who bear the mark of the mill. Oh, we lost them! It's fine. I got this. This highway is the border between the two sides. The only way across is by going under the overpass. Well, those honeysuckle rangers made it under somehow. They've been coming here through the sewer? They figured it out from that tiny piece of my map they stole. They're allowed to eat coconut on their side of the creek? Are you out of your mind, Raj? Do, do you want the king to smell coconut on your breath? The king? On the other side of the creek, there reigns a king. He rules over all, and no one disobeys him. He decides what games to play, what snacks to eat. Every decision and decree is his alone to make. Craig, if the king gets a hold of your map, he'll undoubtedly use that knowledge to spread his influence to this side of the creek and threaten our way of life. So we're guarding this from some evil king over there in Herkleton Mills? I wonder what he's like. No one from our neighborhood has been to the other side. I was there, but I didn't see much. I was running from those honeysuckle rangers the whole time. <gasps> One of us should check it out. <gasps> honeysuckle pollen pummel! <laughs> honeysuckle snatch! Ah! Oh. oh no, we've been tricked by the- Rangers of Honeysuckle! Oh, here it is. The map, the key to everything. Once the king sees this, all our problems will be solved. I'm sorry, my important mission took longer than I thought. Honeysuckle Bell! We got my map! We got it! With that map, the king could take over this side of the creek and threaten all of playtime. What are we gonna do? You're gonna have to go to the other side. When you get to the gates, tell them your water lilies. Pals of the king. Not buddies, not chums, but pals. They'll let you in. The fate of the creek is riding on getting this map. This is the most massive tree fort I've ever seen. Look at that. They have a tailor. Oh, wow, that, that explains the costumes. Oh, Kelsey, check it out. They have an armory. Oh, that's actually pretty nice. You know, I was expecting this place to be full of doom and gloom, but it's more sunshine and smiles. How disappointing. Craig! <gasps> it's the Honeysuckle Rangers! With this piece of geographical intel, the king will be able to expand his reign to the other side of the creek. Ah! What? I got it! Honeysuckle, hold! Sorry! Ah! Ah! Oh my gosh, Raj! The map! Get the map! That's it! You're under arrest! Hands behind your backs! The three of you are coming with us to meet the king! Ahem. 
Sam, your kingliness. We finally obtained it. The map of the other side. Wow, he's right. It's actually legit. Thanks, you can leave. Oh, oh, we've also got some prisoners here that we... I said thanks. After everything we've done to get this for you, all you can say is thanks. You're just a... You selfish jerk! Do you realize how much I do for this creek? Um, I provide free basketballs for any kid in need. I give out free candy to kids whose parents won't let them have sugar. I protect everyone from those monsters on the other side of the creek. Uh, monsters? And still, kids like you want to take advantage of me. D did you just think because you give me a piece of paper that suddenly we're going to be best friends? Because for your information, that is not how friends work. Wait, what? We're sorry, Your Grace. You have every right to be upset with us. You are right. That's not how friends work. We shouldn't have tossed your feelings on the floor like that. We didn't realize how much you've suffered on behalf of our ignorance. If you ever disrespect me like that again, I'll drop you into the maze. Got it? No, I don't got it. Um, who are you? I'm Craig of the Creek. You want that map? You're gonna have to go through me! to keep an eye out for this Craig of the Creek. Green Poncho! We came as soon as we could. What's going on? Craig, I caught these agents of the king trying to sneak over from the other side of the creek. Sean? Raj? Hey, hey Craig. Craig! We're done with the king and his tyrannical rule. But he still controls everything, so our lives are... Super, super uncool. uncool. Why do kids on the other side of the creek listen to that king? He makes you wear those costumes, and he tells you how to play. What, is this charisma modifier plus 30 or something? Even worse, he's got candy. You ever been over to a kid's house who has all the good snacks? That's the king. His family keeps their pantry stocked with brand name soda, brand name chips, and all the best candy. Like squishers. That's how he gets kids to be his friends and do stuff for him. Like build forts, give him toys, and of course, stop anyone else from bringing candy to his side of the creek. Because without candy, the king would be nothing. Like us. Hmm. So you need some help smuggling forbidden candy into your side of the creek. Hey, it's the sugar smugglers! All right! Yeah! Welcome to the candy bar. The place looks great. It's Maya, the king's BFF. The BFF is here? Hide the coconuts! Hide everything! Halt! Who goes there? You're that Craig kid from the other side of the creek. <sighs> Sup? You and your friends, get out of here! But what about you? I'm a little stuffed up, I'll be fine. Go! <gasps> <gasps> Smell you later, Maya. <laughs> oh no. What is going on? I just ran into our old friend, Omar. He was with that Craig kid. This place will be crawling with guards soon. We gotta move. Sure thing, Omar. If that's even your real name. It is. So how did Maya know it? It's complicated. What? what? Tell me your story. Uh, please. Fine, I'll tell you the whole story. Back in the day, Maya and I were tight until Xavier came into our lives. Xavier! How many times do I have to tell you, get out of my chair? <gasps> the king! The time has finally come. As you know, in a few weeks, I will be going off to high school, and hanging out at the creek will no longer be socially acceptable. It's time to pass down the crown. 
This means taking on a lot of responsibilities. You're gonna need to choose a BFF to assist you like I did with my BFF, Randy. Yo, yo, what's up, little prince? Give me a high five. Not now, Randy. Ugh. Listen, I cannot stress enough how important choosing the right BFF is. They have to be the best forever. And then what happened? <sighs> he pitted us against each other to decide who would be his best friend. I thought we were on the same page, but Maya told him to stab me in the back. I was forced to flee. And that's how I met her. Today, I pass the crown to the next king, my little brother, King Xavier! <laughs> What part of stealth mission do you not understand? Presenting the king's new BFF, Maya! We've got training to do. Hear ye, hear ye. The king wants to say, sup. How'd he do? Oh man, I love rhino racers. Crush them. you want a wad of gum in your hair. Well, look who it is to the rescue, the Green Poncho. Or should I call you by your real name? Michelle Green. When you dropped your glasses, I thought you looked familiar. You were in my sister's eighth grade jazz band, which now makes you a high schooler. No. I wonder what your classmates would think if they found out that you were playing superhero with some fourth graders at the creek. You wouldn't. Wouldn't I? You know Randy likes to run his mouth. Uh, what do you want? I want you to leave my creek forever. What, what are you doing? Sometimes people change. Okay, man, it's over. Omar, can we finally be chill now? No, I have no chill. some fireworks coming from the other side. They're to signal a tournament held every year for the king's birthday. It's pretty dangerous over there. And the king is after Craig's map, trying to get intel on our side of the creek. It's just one kid. We're about to go in there four kids deep. We'll go compete in some games, win the prizes, and bounce out of there before dinner. You guys have to keep a low profile. Whoa! These are honey sucking sick! Each costume is for a different rank. There go the acorn knights, some cherry blossoms. And I'm not sure where that guy is, but I like his flaps. The tournament is pretty brutal. All the greatest champions of the King's Knightly Order will be competing, and they play rough. Oh no! Craig, we've been invisibly cuffed! Ah, we don't look in there! Stop! Chill! Chill! No! Ah. You won't get away with this! I will get my map back in. And one more in landscape. <sighs> All done. You can have it back now. Should I let them go? Maze! 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 For violating the laws of the king, you are hereby sentenced to get your sorry butts dropped in the maze. <laughs> Good luck getting out before dinner. Or ever. shouldn't have come here. The king has a picture of my map. I'm sorry, you guys. Nah, this is on me. You guys were all like, it's dangerous. But I was like, I want a hat. And honestly, I should have listened to y'all because these kids were wild. <gasps> the hoses. They looked like a tangled mess, but it was really one hose twisted around. The maze is the same thing. One tangled line. The exit connects to this entrance. So, if we just keep to one side and follow it all the way, we'll get out. Now, it should be just a straight shot to the exit. We made it out. Hey, how'd it go? We won the tournament, but the game caught us and took a picture of my map. We'll talk later. Okay. Wait, what? Get behind me. Green Poncho, what's going on? It's the other side of the creek. They've initiated a snowball war. We're invading! Fire! Green Poncho!
Poncho, do you have any more net arrows? I have an idea. Ah! Get a hold of yourself down there! This is taking forever! Finally, I'll reign over the entire creek and cement my legacy as the greatest king of all! Better than my sister Cheyenne. Better than my brother Kenneth. Hmm? Where did all these kids come from? She said the side was empty. Creek forces attack! Sanctuary for my feetsies. And that's how I became king of the forest. Dang it, it it's over! Wait, these guys are kind of familiar. Like I've seen them somewhere in the creek. That's an anime classic. It's called Haru, King of the Forest. We used to hang out with this guy, Kenneth, who loved that show. He cosplay as Haru all the time. Whoa. Hey, so listen, Grandma, Ugh. my snack supplies are running a little bit low, but I did get a B-plus on my science project. Ugh. That might be worth a couple of bags of snacks to trade, don't you think? Yeah, <sighs> You know, so I can restock. Your Highness, Maya reporting in. Your distraction worked. I think I know how we can take down their side of the creek. We're all out of taco rolls. What? Seriously? Well, do you have any spicy beefers? I'm out of those, too. Well, what do you have? I don't have anything. The trading tree is out of snacks. No, no snacks? snacks? Something sort of happened between me and one of my biggest snack suppliers. My grandma usually trades me snacks in exchange for good grades. But last week, I got this report card in the mail. Ah! No, no! It's okay, Craig. These crates can't hurt you. <sighs> well, I guess I'll see y'all in the fall. You're on your own now. Huh? <gasps> Guys! The creek is filled with squishers! Oh, what? Oh, oh. There's so many of them. Let me see that. The mark of the mill? These are from the king on the other side of the creek. This can't be good. We've got to assemble the Council of the Creek and get to the overpass. Me and my friends run things on the other side of the creek. But when I got word your side had been stricken with famine, we decided to pool our resources to come help our creekly neighbors. I'd love to share even more, but it seems your doorman, the Green Poncho, won't allow us to enter. The Council should take a vote to decide whether or not to let this king into our side. We're free to play how we want and do what we want. And if we want to keep things that way, we cannot let the king enter our side. And now for the vote. Thumbs up to let the king in, thumbs down to keep him out. Poppy? Well, not exactly the warm welcome we were expecting, but thank you all! <laughs> you won't regret this. You'll see we're gonna be very good. Friends. Kittizens of Herkleton Farms. Introducing the bringer of candy, the donor of balls, the savior from the other side, the one and only King Xavier! What? This bounce house and all the candy you can eat could be yours! All you need to do is sign your name and number on one of these emergency contact sheets. Oh, ah, first. Hmm, this tree could use a bit of, uh, sprucing up. My champions, I leave the renovations up to you. You can't just take it! It's not fair! Fair? Why should a king care about the affairs of a horse? Ugh, take some sugar cubes and be gone! The creek has changed so much in just a couple weeks. Ah, <laughs> yeah! 
I hereby declare a horse banned from the creek! Take care of him. Huh? Oh, man. A.K.A. Hmm. Enough of this, Xavier. No amount of candy is worth you coming here and bossing everyone around. So take your snacks and your rude attitude and leave. I knew you would try to oppose me just like Omar did, so I had a contingency plan. What are you doing? Calling your mom. <gasps> Why? Uh, hello? Is this Craig's mom? Well, I was playing at the creek, and your son, he, he, he pushed me! <laughs> you lied. But why would you do that? I never touched you. You got off lucky. I could have messed with your report card like I did with your friend, Kit. <gasps> this is my creek now. Craig, where, where are you going? Home. I think, I think I'm grounded. Craig? You're back. Okay, so how'd it go? Good, so we were able to strike through here and disperse the candy from outside the poison ivy grove to the blacktop. Even with all these raids, we're barely putting a dent in the king's candy supply. We've gotta find some way to get King Xavier out of the creek. I know where the king lives. Wait a minute. I think that's Xavier's older sister, the former king of the other side of the creek, King Cheyenne. I bet she can help us take down Xavier. Look, I don't know what y'all are trying to pull, but my days of playing king at the creek are history, okay? I'm a teenager now. I don't play kid games. Look, we're not here to embarrass you or anything, but this is really important. It's about your little brother. He's gone mad with power. You gotta tell us how to stop him from being king. <laughs> wow, still talking about the king? My legacy continues. Legacy? Kenneth, you started all this royalty stuff, so you deal with these kids. Wait, you started this? Xavier's my baby brother, and uh, I was the original king of the creek. Tell us everything! Well, it all started eons ago, back when I used to play in the creek every day with my pals Mark, Barry, and David. Whoa! You were friends with the elders of the creek? Wow, deepest lore. Back in the olden days, we were just a bunch of nerds who loved to LARP. We'd play in the creek and watch anime together. My all-time favorite was Haru, King of the Forest. Man, I loved it so much, I even dressed like Haru. But one day, the city started building an overpass that cut through the creek. So I wasn't able to go across and see my friends anymore. I felt so sad and alone. And then, something amazing happened. Some kids thought my costume was cool. <laughs> After a while, other kids started dressing up and playing with us. I started bringing candy and all this other stuff, and even more kids showed up to play. Man, it was crazy. My friends started joking and calling me King Kenneth, and it just kind of stuck. After a while, I got too old for the creek. So Cheyenne took the game over and made things a little different. Sounds like she passed it on to Xavier, and now he's running it how he wants. Kenneth basically told us that Xavier is never going to give up being the king or leave our side of the creek alone. Soon enough, he's going to run everyone out of the creek and it'll be abandoned. But if we're losing the creek, we're not going to go down without a fight. We are going to challenge him to a winner-takes-all game of Capture the Flag. Here's the deal. We both want each other out of the creek. I think there's only one solution. I'm proposing a game of Capture the Flag. Your side versus mine. If we win, you and your kingdom are done terrorizing the creek, and kids can go back to playing how they want. And if you win, I'll leave the creek forever. You're on, Craig of the... Where is it you play now? We'll just have to see. Till then, sweet dreams. He's gone! Jason? Craig? You all son of a scout. <laughs> Jason's on our side. He's been working undercover, gather intel on Xavier's forces. Here's what I found out. The king is considering three locations on the other side of the creek to hide his flag. The maze, Fort Wisteria, and the king's keep. Are they ready? Of course they are. Our knights are the greatest this creek has ever seen. This 
is a winner-take-all game of capture the flag. Freeze tag rules. The overpass is the border. Any kid tagged on the opposing side will be frozen in place for the duration of the game. The first to retrieve the flag and return it to their side will rule the creek. The game will begin at the sound of my sousaphone. Mr. Um, Mr. Um, tall guy? Do you think the king can still get us here? This here cardboard fortress is built with the most heavy duty moving boxes that my dad's garage had to offer. You and our flag are as safe as packing peanuts. Hmm. Oh, jeez. JP the Sewer Queen! JP the Sewer Queen! The King's BFF Maya is coming your way! Sewer Queen, huh? Ah! <laughs> That's gonna itch. This Maya girl is really something. That's not an her. JP, we're leaving. Uh, all of us? But how are we? Wait, is this whole fort secretly a giant robot? It ain't a secret if you tell everybody. Run away! <laughs> This is Team Warp Warriors. The flag wasn't here, and our team paid the price. Oh, glitter. But hey, I guess that means it must be with Craig. Well, I know one thing. Their flag definitely isn't here with Team Itchy Babies. And neither is our flag. What? Maya has the flag. Someone has to stop her before she reaches the overpass. This is bad. Kelsey. Can you get there? I'm on my way. I know it seems impossible. But you can't give up, not without putting up a fight. Win or lose, that's what makes a hero. <sighs> huh? <laughs> Are you scared of me? You should be. Do you really think you can stop me? The only way to find out is to try. <laughs> Go ahead, take it. <sighs> Step aside. Sorry, but I can't do that. Well then, batter up. Omar, how did you get here so fast? I got a ride from an old friend. Hey, guess you passed driver's ed. <gasps> the original green poncho? Toss me that bow. Let's do this. Fire! Hand over the flag. Ah, Craig. I'm here for the flag, Xavier. Where is it? Uh, 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 not so fast. One touch and you're frozen. Everything you've done, all the times you've been a thorn in my side, it's all led to this. You've been outsmarted by me, and now you're going to get tagged by me, and you're going to lose your precious creek to me! This is the end for you, and you have no one to blame but yourself, all because you thought you knew better than a king. You don't know the first thing about being a king. You're no Cheyenne, and you're definitely not on Kenneth's level. You're just a bully that gives kids candy so they do what you want. That's why, no matter how much candy you have, deep down, you know that these kids only want to be friends with the king. But nobody wants to be friends with Xavier. Oh, shut your mouth! Whoa! Ah! Why don't you just hand over the coat? <gasps> Tag him now! <laughs> Spark 
Go! Go on, Craig! I'll cover you. <gasps> uh -oh. What's up, Craig? Need a ride? Don't worry about me, Craig. Just run! I gotcha! Ah! Give it! Never! Uh, no! I'll freeze you first! Huh? King Craig now, or...? No. Listen, everybody. The creek is special. It's a place where kids can play how they want. And we don't need a king to tell us how to do that. Because the creek belongs to all of us. So, we've triumphantly vanquished tyranny from the creek. What now? Well, now that the king's gone, there's a whole other side of the creek to explore. <laughs> <laughs>